Hi Scotties, Miss Pollard here on a quick tutorial on how to get to your Google Classroom. The first thing you need to make sure is that you have Google Chrome open. If you have Google Chrome open, open a new tab, which is this plus sign at the top of your screen, until you see the Google Doodle, which will appear in the middle of your screen. The next thing you need to do is go over to the right hand corner. Right here you will either see a circle with a Google profile or you will see a blue rectangle that says sign in. Click one of those. Scroll down. You may have some other people in your house that are logged in but you need to log in so you need to click add another account. After you click add another account you may have to come down here and click use another account. The Google sign in box will pop up. Right here start typing your Gmail student username which is the one we use at school. Make sure you type dcpsnet.org and not gmail.com. Click next. You will come up to a screen where you have to put in your password. Everyone should know their password. It's your 99 number. Remember, don't tell anybody keeping your password a secret is very important. Next, you want to click the next button and give it a second and now you are signed into Google. Over here in the right hand corner, now the circle, the Google profile, if you hover over the top of it, it should say your name. To the left of it is a Rubik's Cube. Click on the Rubik's Cube. A drop down will appear you need to click on Google Classroom. The Google Classroom screen will appear. Yours may be empty if you have not joined a class yet, but I have joined this class so you can see this is one, I have one class that appears right here. Next, come over to the right hand corner and click on the plus sign and click it will say join a class. You want to join the class with the class code. Your teacher may have given you a class code. You need to enter it here. After you enter the class code, click join and you will be in the Google Classroom. Thanks for watching. If you have any more questions, get in contact with your teacher. Thank you.